about deleting buttons. So typically it's highly advised to not delete any buttons just so that we don't lose integrity of the system. And typically words are on the device for a reason. So hiding and unhiding is where that really comes into key, um, especially for the student's level if you are needing to reduce some vocabulary hide some buttons instead. Um, always make sure you're con um, consulting with the student's team and the speech therapist as well. Another important thing is that there is no undo button on touch chat. So once you delete something, it is gone and you would have to either create that new button in some way. All right, so let's go in and let's delete some buttons. Eat. Eat. So I'm gonna delete applesauce. So I'm gonna go to menu edit page and I'm going to tap applesauce and I see that it says remove button from page so I'm going to go ahead and tap it and I'm going to hit OK and the button is gone. Next I also want to remove salsa so I don't want salsa as a choice or right, this student doesn't like salsa and it says remove button set from the page. Well that's different that means that that button exists on other pages in the device. So if you delete this button, it's going to remove the button on all the other pages in this device. So for example, it's not only in snacks, so I'm going to hit done. It is also in condiments because it's considered a condiment as well. So if you want to keep that button on the device, then do not remove that button set. Okay. And then that is it. Thank you.